Welcome to the Daily Challenge for November 14th, 2014. Let's begin.
that obsidian obsidian repair can do a lot more damage. But I'm kind of committed to the gold one. I mean, if you use this skillfully, you can just get so much more gold.
Oh. I... Honestly, I wasn't even thinking about the big boss. I never defeated the boss for that level? It wasn't even on my mind. I was just like, man, I'm having a good time. Things are going smooth. I'm killing so many things. I just kind of assumed I killed it. I was not expecting that. I, I was not expecting that at all. Huh. Okay. <laughs> I was taking my sweet time, I wasn't even thinking about it. I wasn't like, oh my god, I gotta find the big boss. I just thought, yeah, just keep going around and things will take care of themselves. Whoops. <clears throat> Nonetheless, that was an extremely smooth run. 100% smooth right up until the moment I died. Which is, well, usually how it goes. Actually, no, it's not usually how it goes. Typically I take some stupid damage, but in this case, I don't think I took... Yeah, I didn't take any damage from enemies. I only took damage from getting the uh, ping ping with my hearts at the blood shop for the golden rapier. Aside from that, I don't think I took a single point of damage up until the point where I died. That was a really smooth run. Killed by a green banshee. See how we did? Not bad. Number 23, and actually that's pretty damn good considering the fact that it's 6, 7, 8, 9. It's about... Four and a half hours, roughly, after the daily challenge switched over, which is quite a while. Plenty of time for people to get some very good scores in. Yeah, that was a very smooth run. Very, very smooth. One of the smoothest I've ever had. Typically, I take some stupid damage or something like that. But in this case, did I even... You know what? I don't think I even ever lost my coin multiplier. Ever. Did I? I mean, maybe you lose it when you get the when you take damage at the heart shop for buying the golden rapier, but I don't think I ever lost it. You know, on accident. That was a really smooth run, and I was having a lot of fun too, like, just, I don't know if... I'm not sure if it's obvious or not, but I keep hitting those uh, slow down and speed up tempo quite a bit, and that's not an accident. I mean, I know they're supposed to be traps, I, I guess. But, at this point, I kinda just hit them for fun. Because I don't think I've ever really lost my coin multiplier to a tempo up or tempo down. It's not really too hard to keep my tempo going, even after activating one of them. But I'm just doing it for fun, because it's just kind of neat to have everything kind of slow down or speed up and have to keep up with it. So I was doing that, man. I was going all over the place, speeding and slowing down time and doing all sorts of fun stuff. Yeah, that was a really good run. It didn't get incredibly far, but it did feel good. Just everything just worked. Alright, well, that has been the Daily Challenge for November 14th, 2014. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.